that we start by saying that um, such uh, barbaric uh, killings should not have a place in the 21st century. Uh, whatever the uh, provocation is, whatever the excuse, we it just uh, the, the, this type of killing offends our sense of decency and our sense of um, humanity on many levels. Uh, with that said, I think that you know we shouldn't uh, isolate the case of uh, Miss uh, Samuel because it is the latest in a long line of. Um, such incidents uh, in northern Nigeria, where mostly minority Christians in this Muslim majority region are targeted uh, for, you know, and are accused of uh, blaspheming the religion of Islam or the prophet of Islam, and are, you know, essentially lynched you know, even without being uh, given uh, the uh, privilege of going through the judicial process of having legal representation and of evidence being presented. Uh, it has to be said also that um, it is not only Christians, however, that have been targeted in this uh, new uh, effort on the part of uh, certain segments of the Muslim majority population of Northern Nigeria to enforce what they regard as respect for the prophet of Islam. Certain Muslim intellectuals and dissenters, and um, you, you could call them uh, insurgents, have also been targeted. As we speak, there is a person by the name of uh, Bala Muhammad who is languishing in a prison somewhere in Kano, I believe who has been on trial for blasphemy. Uh, there was the incident of a young man who we now know was uh, mentally challenged, who was lynched in uh, a part of Bauchi State, also on accusation of blasphemy. The other thing that needs to be said is that in many of these cases, uh, from the case of Gideon Kaluka in the 90s in Kanu, uh, to the case of the youth copper in a Christian youth copper who was uh, also murdered uh, in Bauchi or Gumbe, uh, and then to the case of the woman who was murdered as well for blasphemy again in Kano a couple of years ago. In all these situations, uh, or in most of them, I should say, uh, we never get to actually even uh, see the evidence. Uh, so the, the the accusation of blasphemy is never proven. Uh, the obviously the accused are never given an opportunity to defend themselves. And so it could very well be that uh, some of these people have been lynched and murdered in a gruesome fashion, simply on a mere accusation of uh, doing something that probably they didn't do.